What's up guys, it's Jamie Messina here and today I'm going to be answering a common question that I get in my keto groups. That question is, why aren't my pee strips showing me in ketosis anymore? Is this you? You just started on your keto diet, you're all excited, you've been strict as hell, starting to feel the effects of ketosis. You got your fancy new little pee strips here from Amazon or wherever the hell you get them. Peed on them, it's all dark and you're all pumped because the darker it is, the more you're in ketosis, right? Every time you go to the bathroom, you're all like holding it in till you get your pee strip out. Maybe that was just me. Regardless, they keep changing color, you're all pumped, just going along on this little keto journey, dropping weight, feeling good, having all these non-scale victories, your clothes are feeling better, and you're all, woo! Then one day you realize, my pee strip's not changing any color anymore. Um, what's happening here? Why aren't I getting into ketosis anymore? What am I doing wrong? Here's the deal, guys. When you first start out on the ketogenic diet, your body is producing ketones, but it's also still running on glucose, which means that you're still burning glucose as a fuel source, but you aren't eating that glucose anymore, and so ketones are present in your bloodstream, but you're peeing them out, and that's showing up on your little peach strip. Now, as you keep rocking your ketogenic journey, eventually you become fat adapted. Don't worry, that's a good thing. So that's a really good sign because it means what you're doing is working. In fact, one of the signs that it is working is when your pee strips stop changing color. Why? Because your body is no longer peeing out those ketones. It's utilizing them for fuel. Woo! Your body is becoming a ketone machine and it's using those ketones effectively. That means that they're no longer showing up on those pee strips, and that's a good thing. Now, if you were falling off track and um, you know your ketogenic diet isn't working for you anymore, you're not gonna need a pee strip to tell you that. You're gonna notice a difference in the way that you're feeling, in your energy, in your brain fog, mental clarity, mood, all of that stuff. So, these pee strips are great in the beginning uh, when you're first starting your ketogenic diet, or if you've fallen off track and you're getting back onto it, getting your shiz back together, but as you move along in your ketogenic journey, you're not gonna need it. The strip is gonna let you know that there's ketones present in your blood, that your body is producing them again, and that you're about to be that ketone machine real quick. So the moment that you notice that your pee strip isn't changing anymore and you know that you're eating right, you're doing what it takes and you're following everything correctly, just get rid of them. They aren't gonna work for you anymore. Now, if you really wanna know if your body is in ketosis, the blood tester is the best way to go. And I'm gonna go ahead and post a link to one in the notes below, so check that out if you're interested. But here's the thing guys, if you know that you're doing it right, you're following, you're tracking, and you know that you've stuck to your plan, and you can feel it in, in the way that you feel, in your energy, in your focus, all that stuff, other than the scale, because the scale's a liar, continue to do what you're doing. Why did I say other than the scale? Because the road to success is not a straight shot. There are gonna be a lot of ups, a lot of downs, a lot of ups, downs, down, 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 down. and that's okay, it's part of the game, as long as you keep your head in the game. So you can actually throw that scale out or let it collect dust like I do and use it like twice a year. Okay, so let's recap. The pee strips are great in the beginning of your journey. It's going to let you know that your body's producing ketones, that you're on the right track, that you're peeing them out, that you're still burning glucose. But as you move along and as you become fat adapted, you can get rid of them. Just keep doing what you're doing. Focus on the way that you feel, on the way that your clothes fit, Trust the process, and remember that Rome wasn't built in a day. Give yourself a break. So if your pee strips aren't changing anymore, don't let that throw you off. It just means that you're doing the right thing. You're just fat adapted now, and that's a good thing. 
All right, guys, so that's the answer to the question about the pea strips. If you know you're following the diet right, you know you're doing the right thing, don't worry about this, don't worry about the scale, just keep on your journey, stay focused, stay, stay pumped, stay motivated, keep that head in the game, put the blinders on, forget the scale, all that good stuff, and just focus on what you're doing. You're going to see success. Rome wasn't built in a day, neither was your body. All right, guys, I'll be back here again to answer some more questions. If you have anything that you'd like me to answer, please post them in the comments below I will take questions and find out the answer for you and share it here all right guys if you liked what I had to say please give it a thumbs up a share a follow all that good stuff whatever it takes all right guys have a good day talk to you soon bye